Hello again, and um, today I'm going to be flip flipping through um, everything that I've done for my art class. Um, so I've got all the drawings here, and yeah, I'm going to flip through each and every single one of them. So yeah, so for the first drawing, we basically had to um, uh, paint our hands and then make an imprint on a piece of paper. And I actually uh, moved school, so it was my first day and I had art. Um, so I didn't know we had to bring our own paints, so someone lent me theirs, and the colour selection isn't something I would have liked. But yeah, I did an imprint of um, my hands, so yeah. And next, um, we basically, ju she just told us to draw whatever we want, so obviously yeah, I just drew some doodles. Um, I'm just kidding, I'm obviously leaving Charlotte this one stuff here, as my style was not that good, definitely. Um, so yeah, it was a lot of doodles, but overall, I guess it was pretty fun to um, so we, she gave us this homework um, to just paint whatever and I actually didn't know we had some until the day before that so I just quickly just stole my brother's watercolours and I just tried to whip something up and honestly I hate this a lot it is completely just absolutely terrible um, so yeah it's not the best and here in class uh, I didn't have a device to search a reference so she just told us to uh, draw a vase of flowers so I just had a gel pen um, so I just decided to doodle some flowers from my imagination. Honestly I'm not really sure how much I like this but I do think it is quite alright considering that I did not have much time to do this and I did not have a reference and the pen was one of those inky pens so I didn't really have a chance to actually try, I guess. So obviously here, um, I just doodled in class because I had nothing else to do really. I absolutely hate these drawings uh, and here I decided to draw myself. Um, it's not the best but I just decided to draw the clothes I was wearing and a random girl from my class, so yeah. On this you've probably seen on my community post and I just decided to draw some sunflowers and some mountains in the background and this took me a really long time it definitely took me a few hours but overall I do think this is pretty cute in my opinion uh, I do like how um, the mountains turn out in the background but I don't like that I added a line art for the sunflowers as I think they make them look a lot more cartoony so I personally would have chosen a lighter brown to line it and here we had to just draw a book cover um, here, she told us to draw something that resonates with what we want to become um, when we are adults basically. And I want to become a doctor so here are just a bunch of things to do with. I guess uh, the medicine industry, so I just decided to draw a lot of things. Um, so yeah, also if you're wondering why I'm holding one here is just because it has my full name in it. Um, so I'm not going to show it for privacy reasons. Um, so here, I'm going to have to blow that out, here I just decided to draw a random eye because she just told us to draw whatever we want so I decided to just go for you a random realistic eye and I'm not sure how realistic it looks, I think it's alright but I do think I made the shadows too dark in some places and I didn't add enough highlights for the crease in the eye above. And here again she just told us to draw whatever we want so I just drew this without a reference, I'm not sure how much I like it. I like it as it's very basic, it's very simple and it's pretty smudged from staying in a pile for so long. So the balance was a lot better but I did do this without a reference and I'm not sure when I did this because I didn't really write any dates so yeah I just decided to draw a random girl. And here in class she just decided to, uh, she just told us to, uh, we had to pick three of our favourite fruits and just draw them in a fruit bowl. Um, so I did this in pencil because I didn't have any of my art supplies with me. Um, so yeah, I chose a pineapple, grapes and watermelon, which I think are my top three favorites, apart from um, mangoes and stuff, which is also good, but I can't have a choose a favorite. So here again, she just told us to draw a vase of our favorite flowers. Um, so I did this again, this was also in class, uh, and I do like, however, uh, what the uh, glass face looks like. I do think it looks pretty good and I do think it gives the impression of it being transparent. And here she just told us to draw um, our favourite day from our Christmas holidays because this was in the Christmas season and me and my family went um, to a restaurant in the mountains and obviously this image does not look remotely close to 
how it actually looks because the detail that it would have to take uh, would take ages so I just got really mad so I decided to scribble everywhere which is the biggest mistake I've ever done since I think it would have looked much much better if I didn't do that in the first place and here she told us to draw ourselves how we imagine ourselves to be in 10 years so I just decided to draw myself in a doctor's costume. I'm not really sure how or what they exactly look like so I just searched something up on Pinterest and decided to use that as a reference. Um, but yeah, I think it looks alright, nothing special. And then she just told us to draw our favourite um, book character from when we were children and I decided to draw a little red riding hood um, but I'm not really a fan of how it turned out and she just told us to draw them however we interpreted them. So yeah, this is what she looks like in my head. Um, so yeah, and here uh, in my country I have a festival uh, with stuff I can't really say exactly I don't know how to explain but I just decided to draw one of the things that everyone gives um, and I do think it looks alright I tried to do um, it in realism and I do think it looks pretty nice and here as you can see I completely rushed this we had to draw something that um, like symbolizes Easter so I decided to just draw a random easter egg and as you can tell I completely rushed this I put no effort in it whatsoever and it's very clear um, so we also had to draw our favourite day from Easter so I decided to draw um, my religion's cross which is a Christian Orthodox um, so yeah I just decided to do something simple and I think it looks cute um, but I kind of rushed the interior and last but not least, uh, I have this portrait that I made, which I did post on, and I did post this on uh, the community post, which I posted last time, I think. And um, so yeah, I do think it turned out really nice. I think it looks a lot better in person than on camera. On camera, it just looks weird and smudged, but in person, it looks really nice in my opinion. Um, so she just told us um, that we just had to draw um, to recreate um, an artist's painting. Uh, so I will put up the original on screen and I just recreated it in my style. And I do think it looks pretty cute. I do think the lip is wonky. I just, her face angled in another direction yet her lips are another way. Um, so yeah, and I do not like how I did the shading for the underneck. I used a marker that was too dark and I tried to make it lighter. So it looks very weird and waxy. Um, so yeah, I'm not a huge fan of that. Um, but yeah, here are all my drawings from my art class this year. Um, I do think uh, I do have a few more coming up but I just decided that I have nothing to film. Uh, so yeah but this was, video was a pretty short one but I hope you guys enjoyed the rest. Um, so bye!